and again let me say this if you are not saved now would be a good time for you to be saved if you are watching this you have never trusted the lord jesus christ as your savior now would be the best time to do so my dear brothers and sisters you must realize that you are a sinner you must realize that the wages of sin is death and that is not the end of it the bible says the wicked will be turned into hell you are going to hell one day when you die and if you are not saved when the church is raptured you are going to be left behind on this earth and you are going to come face to face with this being called the antichrist the most evil the most demonic person to have to ever come onto the face of the earth that would be the antichrist you don't want to be there in that time it's going to be hell on earth after the church is raptured you don't want to be there you want to be safe with jesus christ so you must realize that you are a sinner and that you deserve to go to hell my dear brothers and sisters you must also know that god loved you and sent his son jesus christ to die on the cross for your sins he took your place upon the cross he bore your sins he took your punishment he paid the penalty for your sins he died he was buried and he rose up again to save you from your sins to save you from hell to give you eternal life my dear brethren if you believe that jesus died for your sins was buried and rose up again that is the gospel if you believe the gospel if you put your trust in jesus christ you will be saved right now right now my dear brothers and sisters please don't neglect the gospel your good works will not save you from hell your living a morally upright life will not save you sharing and caring will not save you loving people will not save you none of these things are going to save you the only thing that's going to save you is faith in what jesus christ did for you on the cross the only person who can save you is jesus christ and he wants you to believe that the bible says if you believe on the lord jesus christ you will be saved right now my prayer is that you would do that and that you would do it right now my dear brothers and sisters so don't neglect your salvation our life is so short don't think oh i will i will think about jesus christ and i will believe tomorrow and day after tomorrow don't think like this why because your life is short what happened next to moment you don't know okay what what's happened to your life you don't know future we don't know so please realize you are a sinner and believe on the lord jesus christ right now my dear brothers and sisters thank you thank you very much